Hello YouTube, welcome back to Screaming at Joypad, and today we're going to be trying out Mannequin. Now, I don't know anything about Mannequin, other than I assume it's a game about mannequins, which can be inherently quite spooky, or can be very hilariously not spooky. So, we're going to find out which one this falls into, but you mean you know how YouTube works by now, I don't need to go through all that with you, so let's dive straight in and let's see what this is all about. Well, this door isn't at all what I pictured. Um, excuse me, but it shouldn't matter if I bought these clothes three months ago. So curse you, and this store as well. <laughs> I like that went from customer to old lady. Like, the, the tone changed. Cares to make anyone happy. Go home, old lady. Goddamn boomers. Oh, okay. Ooh, that's, that's a, <laughs> I like the. I quite like that the menu is a mobile phone. That sensitivity needs turning down just a smidge. Is it? Oh, God, fuck. I immediately pressed the home button then. Resume. That'll do. That'll do nicely. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 beep. God, I've never worked in a place like this. And I, d I don't think I could. I really don't. I've worked in retail, which is horrific. But I don't think I could work in a place like this. What the hell? What the fuck? I need to check the circuit in there. I was like, why the f why is the time on the flashlight? It's not, it's my phone. The sensible thing that most people don't do in horror horror situations. Aye aye? Alright. That's a that's a wicked haircut you've got. Either that or it's um it's like a really bizarre hat. Uh, check the circuit in the back, I think. I think it said. You all got the same haircut. Okay, I see. I think I see what's going on here. X L to XXL. This is very un unrealistic clothing sizes because dresses don't come in lettered sizes. Dresses come in numbers. I know this. I'm a... How <laughs> hello. May I post a like? You can post a like if you want. Right. Oh, hello. <laughs> yeah, I don't like the smoothing of the mouse sensitivity. That feels weird. That feels like you're covering something up. Then how big is this fucking shop? Oh. <laughs> when I first met him, I almost asked him if his name was Mike. <laughs> uh. Uh. Did any of you move? Oh, you moved. Oh, no, you didn't. Let's turn this up a smidge. It's a mall in America. So it can be a That's true, actually. I forget I, I forget that the one time I've been to a, an American mall, it was fucking ginormous. Have I gone back to the beginning? I've gone back to the beginning. I've done a stupid. This, a mannequin stood here. I'm a ranger now. I'm a horror ranger. A mannequin stood here. Be careful. Their movement is based on vision. <laughs> Not vision based on movement. If you walk backwards, nothing can hurt you in a horror game. Immediately dies. Uh, authorized personnel only. I'm an what? So electric doors are out too. So uh, what? Well, yeah. The desk. Think, w at least one step ahead. Like, oh, sorry, just, what's this way? Is this death? How low is this roof that I can hear the rain? Oh my days. Oh, I can run. Brilliant. <gasps> I'm a, oh. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Do, uh, if, do I die if I touch you? No, I don't. This is. This is atmospheric spooks. 
Many mannequins once stood here. I know that because they were here literally 30 seconds ago. Ah, oh, hello. I'm being chased by athleisure mannequin. Desk, desk, de oh, key. That key was not there a minute ago. I checked all of these desks. I'm going to have to just scooch past you real quick. Never. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> oh. Do you only move if I look away? <laughs> Sorry, I'm having too much fun with that. Strike an athletic pose. Oh no, it's coming after me in a very slowly scripted way. Can I shut the door? Shut the door! Fucking hell. Why is the fire extinguisher all over there? And why do I feel like I'm in a judo hall with these... Oh, circuit breaker. Breaker! Let me try to fix this. Let me try to fix this. Okay, cool. Let me... Are you, uh, electrical engineering, Nothing apparently. Seems to work. Nothing seems to work. So you poke it with a stick. I'll leave to the exit back here. Uh, okay. Someone else can fix this tomorrow. Yep, that's the attitude. That's an excellent attitude to have. Somebody else's problem. You are not paid enough for this, friend. You are not paid enough. Are these going to be all full of mannequins? Oh, fucking brilliant. What's wrong with your neck? <laughs> Peekaboo! Peekaboo! Oh, God. Oh, Jesus. Do you mind not pointing that at me? The ones with the turned round, twisted round neck is a bit, is a bit disturbing. I won't lie. The... Oh. No, oh. <laughs> I heard like a. I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna go now, okay? Alright? I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. What the fuck? No! We all saw that. I'm sorry, am I now in the back rooms? I'm just... Musty yellow carpet and fluorescent lighting. I... Well, I gotta admit, this is not what I expected from this. I am in the back rooms. This is really bizarre. Have I, I've clipped through reality. One liminal space room with a chair. Oh, fuck. Do you mind? Do you mind? Oh, no. Oh, no, you don't mind. Oh. Uh, 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 I'm going to go. I'm going to go this way. Oh, you're not even stepping. You're just sliding. You're just fucking ice skating. All of the tropes, all of the time. Absolutely bang on, Expensive. <laughs> so <laughs> Get fucking looped. Oh, you go through. Oh, okay, bye. Of course, it doesn't have collision. Run, run. <laughs> 
You have quite a lot of stamina. Have you ever thought of being a phasmophobia ghost hunter? Uh, this way. This way. Exit. Exit. You fuckers. I should have seen that coming. Should have seen it coming. I feel like there's a fly in my ear because of the fucking horrible fluorescent buzzy light noise. Oh, ghost orbs. Yeah. Ghost orbs. Uh, let's go head towards this exit one then, shall we? What the fuck? Well, I don't know where that came from. This is a metal detector. It is. Beep, 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 beep. I am a robot. Oh, it is an actual exit. Okay, bye. Uh, bye. Oh, shit. Oh, I'm in a changing room. Oh, okay. Oh, there's not one mannequin. Oh. I could probably put my phone away now, right? There's not one mannequin staring at me. And there's... Not one mannequin in the shop. Oh, fuck. Well... Well, you're very welcome. Okay, let's roll that back before well, we end. This door isn't at all what I pictured. Fucking do one, love. Get out. Get um, out of it. Go on, piss me, off. It shouldn't matter if I bought these clothes three months ago. So curse you. And cute, cute escape. Piss off. Piss off, flesh bag. I got a ghost to. Key. Take the key. Take the key. That's a ginormous key. What kind of key is the size of a key? It's like the the width the of a keyboard. Right, now take the key. I need to now, check the circuit in the back. You need to take the key. Fucking hell. Fucking zoomers. Hey, bloody young people. Right, so what I want to do is I want to have a look at the rest of the back rooms because we, we skipped a bit there. Pretty certain that's not going to kill me. Oh, well, who who knew? Who knew that was an actual well, spook? Is, um, excuse, so Go away. To curse you and all halflings. Okay, even care to make any more. What the hell? Come on. I need to check the circuit in the back. Alright, we'll keep an eye on it now then. Yep, it's locked. Two electric doors are out too. Yep. Forgot the master key at the desk. You did. Conveniently. Do you fucking. Don't you dare, mate. Oh, I've gone the wrong pissing way. Oh, it's the changing rooms. It's the changing rooms of death. Uh, no, no, you don't. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, because uh, yeah, we missed a couple of bits in the back rooms there, so I wanted to just have a quick look to see what it was. It could be nothing, but it could be not nothing. Do you fuck off? Fuck, don't. Do you mind teleporting Tina? Beep boop. Let me, try to fix this. Let me try to fix this with my bare hands and my no skills. This seems to work. I'll leave to the exit back here. Yep, go for it. Uh, no, that one. Someone else can fix this tomorrow. Yep, that sounds like a good plan. Bye. See you later. See ya. Oh, horrible creaky fucking noise. 
that that is a genuinely horrible noise the 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 creaking of the ceramic neck go through the door yeah backwards what is this place right so we got one room here and then we got is that a tv i didn't see that last time oh it's a it's a it's a thingy it's a oh fucking what's it called register Oh, because I ran away because the thing was skating towards me, wasn't it? Then we go this way. And now we have a four-way thing. Oh, no, now we have a two-way thing. Now this goes this way. And this is where I tried to loop it around the table and it walked through the table because it's a prick. Oh, but there's an exit this way as well. All right, calm down. It's nowhere near you. So what's this way then? Oh no, maybe that is the way I went a minute ago. Can I get back this way? Right. Aha, so that leads to exit. God, there's quite a few rooms, isn't there? Is this back? Is this where I came from? No. But this is just a chair. Slightly gratuitous use of woman out of breath dot wav. I won't lie. Right, so this is the four way split, right? So if I go this way, this falls off. Yeah, cool. And then that's a way, and then this is a way we haven't been. Which is good, because this is also a way we haven't been. So this is just changing. It's not procedurally, but like scripted changes. So I chose not to go towards that exit. So that's the table room got it oh and that's the cashier that's the register room okay cool so that was it yeah that was the only that was the only thing we, we missed was this version of this room yeah because we're going here oh even the furniture's changed in here which is weird hiya you all right Oh, you're gone. Okay, I just need to not look at you for a second, and then you then you bugger off. Got it. Now I go this way, and it's the actual exit. Uh, what if I go this way? I'd be fucking awful in the actual back rooms. I would get so lost and so killed. <laughs> I just need to bow to them, and they just vanish. Okay, so yeah, no, one big circuit. Cool. That's very recognisable. Run! Run to the exit room! Run! Ah. Ah. To the changing room! There we go. Now, is there anything I can actually do when this changes? <gasps> oh, no, it just... Uh, I lose <gasps> all control. Okay. Well, that's... All right! Okay, so that was Mannequin, and it was a little light on the ground. Um, it was a little light on everything, really. It was a nice experience, but uh, everything seemed a weird proportion, and it's kind of what I'd consider to be a good example of an indie horror game, which isn't always a compliment, unfortunately. It's got a good idea. Mannequins are inherently quite spooky, um, especially in the dark. Uh, there was some good use of sound. There was good and bad use of sound. 
The bad use of sound was the character always being out of breath because we were running and that got very annoying. The good use of sound was the mannequins and necks turning made a weird almost ceramic scrape. That's a noise the the sort of is instilled, not instilled, but like that makes me think of horror movies and of a weird kind of porcelain doll coming after me, which which felt quite nice, but otherwise a pretty mediocre experience. But it's an indie horror game and maybe the developer's going to go on to you know learn new things do bigger and better things and bigger better experiences i hope they do i genuinely do because um, i'd like to see more i'd like to see more refined versions of this to be honest with you um but you know how youtube works i'm not going to tell you how to do what how to do all of that so stay safe stay spooky and i'll see you in the next screaming at a joypad thanks so much everyone